Hello, I'm Stefano Bonaccina, CTO with Advention, and I'd like to introduce the Screen Capture Manager features to you. Confidential information, intellectual property, customer data, health records. Those are the kind of company information mostly subjected to data leakage. Even through a simple function such as using the print screen button or the snipping tool, it becomes possible to capture sensitive information to export outside the company. Screen Capture Manager gives you complete control over the screen capture features of every PC on your network. Configuring Screen Capture Manager is an easy and straightforward process. Just point your favorite browser to the web console and enter your administrator username and password. The configuration GUI is divided in four panes. In the User Configuration pane, you can see all the licensed and configured users. And you can also review the status of any of them to see if a user is enabled, disabled or, or needs to be shadowed. In the Computer Status pane, you will be shown the status of the SCM agents on the PCs on your network. The Administrator pane is used to configure Active Directory or LDAP settings and the agent behavior. Now let's start installing an agent on a network PC. The agent can be remotely installed. We just need to select the remote PC and click on Install. Once installed, we can go to work on the PC. As you may see, the tray icon says the user can capture on screen images. I'm going now to perform a task I've been allowed to. I'm connecting to a database containing customer's data, names, addresses, along with credit card numbers. Now I want to capture all those data by pressing the print screen of my keyboard. Then I run the paint program and I will copy the grabbed screen into an image file. This is actually the same status of every PC without the screen capture manager installed. Now I'm going to show how to disable the screen capture features. This feature can be easily disabled for any required users without any need to reboot the computers. Let's show what happens on the user's PC. The user is still connecting to the customer database to get some confidential data. He presses the print screen key but now he is warned the feature has been disabled. He will not be able to do any paste into any other application. Now I'm going to show you how the shadow feature can help monitoring user access to confidential data. The shadowing is a feature that can be enabled to grab a copy of the image captured by the PC user and store it in an area that can be accessed by the auditor or the security manager for an audit review. I'm now configuring SCM to grab a copy of any image the user Stefano is going to capture. Stefano is now configured to be shadowed. As you may see, the tray icon says the same. Every image the user captures will be shadowed. The user captures the data via the print screen key and copies the capture screen into an image file. Since the shadow feature is enabled, the screen image is sent to the application server and copied in a selected server folder. On the server, you can easily identify the user and the system which the image has been grabbed from.
here's the capture the screens and this one is the latest one The tray icon can be disabled so that it will not appear on the user's PC and the user is not informed that he cannot capture screenshots. The tray icon is disabled but notifications will be shown to the users. Let's go back to the user PC. I run an application and try to capture the screen. The user can be notified he is not able to capture the screen even without letting him know there is an agent running on his machine. The user cannot paste any data. Now we will have a look at, at how new users will be managed. As new users need to be monitored, you can add them to the SCM database. Just select the users you want to monitor by group, individually or importing all of them. I'm importing now the users George. To do this, SCM connected to AD LDAP and got the users list. The new user George has been imported. I'm disabling his screen capture feature and later I will connect to a machine with the same user. SCM works under Windows 7 and Windows Vista as well. On those systems, beside the print screen key, there's another tool to screen capture, the snipping tool. I installed the agent on a new system and I will connect it. On the Windows 7 system, the user George is able to open a secret document kept on a file server on the network. He can open it, but the PDF file is protected, so the user cannot print it or save it without knowing the proper password. Let's have a look at the document properties. Everything is disabled here. Even the copy to the clipboard cannot be done. The user tries to capture the content using the print screen but the screen capture features have been disabled. Also the snipping tool cannot be used. The user has no way to steal this information. Now I want to configure the user George to shadow the content he captures. In a matter of seconds, the status is replicated to the client machine. George runs the snipping tool, captures the window and saves it into a file. In a matter of seconds, the SCM agent copies the image file to the application server. We can find it under the folder we configured in the SCM administration pane. Screen Capture Manager gives you complete control over the screen capture features of every PC on your network.